Baylor St. Luke's is a nationally recognized hospital and home to the Texas Heart Institute with a rich history featuring Dr. Cooley. Texas Children's Hospital is a world-renowned site for pediatric care, where radiologists participate directly in interdisciplinary teams to help patients and clinicians navigate the rarest diseases and syndromes. MD Anderson Cancer Center is a pioneering institution for oncological research and treatment of the wide spectrum of malignancies that afflict patients all over the nation and world. The Michael E. DeBakey VA Medical Center is the largest VA in the country. Fentop Hospital is the level one trauma center for Harris County in Texas, where residents receive the core of their training and treat the most diverse patient populations. The training program here at Baylor is incredibly strong. When I was looking for training programs, I knew that I was a hands-on learner and I wanted to come to a program that would foster that. I wanted to be reading high volumes and be granted high levels of autonomy, and that's what I've found here at Baylor. There are multiple opportunities for our residents to engage in educational activities, whether it be giving lectures to medical students, incoming radiology residents, or residents in other specialties. We have ample opportunities at Baylor College of Medicine. Starting as an R2, you're already operating as a fellow. Even if you're just going through diagnostic radiology, you'll still get very significant hands-on exposures with procedures, which I think is really what separates us from a lot of other programs. Our residents are empowered to develop independence quickly in both our clinical and procedural skills. This is due in large part to our volume and the breadth of pathology that we have in the Texas Medical Center. It is just amazing to see how the residents here are able to work directly with our faculty and program and administration to truly make things happen. Residents can be leaders in research, quality improvement, and diversity initiatives with the powerhouse research being done at our world-class affiliates, Texas Children's and MD Anderson. There truly is a way for any and every resident to find their niche, excel and lead all while enjoying the journey. Our residency program is one of the things I'm most proud about here at Baylor College of Medicine, and we really rely on them to be integrated members of the healthcare team. We work alongside the residents, we teach the residents, and over the course of their residency training, four or five years, uh, we really see them blossom into full-grown radiologists. We have a lot of resources available uh, in terms of scanners. We have a center for advanced MRI imaging. Uh, we have investigators, we have statisticians, we have people interested in neural networks and artificial intelligence, and our residents form ideal partners for these folks to be able to get involved in research projects. The McNair campus is an exciting new development here at Baylor. This is a new hospital that's going up and a new outpatient imaging center. It's going to house some of our premier service lines at Baylor College of Medicine, including uh, neurology, neurosurgery, cardiovascular care, transplant, and importantly, the Dan L. Duncan Cancer Center, which is an NCI-designated cancer center housed here at Baylor College of Medicine. I see tremendous opportunity as we move forward here at Baylor College of Medicine to really get involved in the cutting edge of healthcare. Welcome to the Baylor College of Medicine Radiology Residency Program. We're so excited for you to be joining us here today. My name is Mike Salinas, one of the radiology residents here at Baylor. I'm standing in front of the Baylor College of Medicine fountain, which is at the heart of our campus. We are surrounded by the Texas Medical Center with all the hospitals that we have the privilege of rotating through, all within walking distance of each other. Behind me is the Medical School Colon Building, where we'll be taking a tour today. Our radiology faculty have a very prominent presence here on campus. As you can see, Dr. Tamara Ortiz Perez, one of our breast faculty, is a member of the BCM Senate. Dr. Christy Lincoln, one of our neuroradiology faculty, is the head of the BCM Senate. Our chairman, Dr. Eric Roran, is a fantastic visionary for our department. Over the years, he has helped build many strong relationships with other specialties here at Baylor and with other hospitals within the Texas Medical Center. Here at the medical school, we have our regularly scheduled lectures and didactics. This is the Jaworski Lecture Hall, where we have our regularly scheduled noon conferences. Right now, we implement a hybrid lecture system where residents attend either in person or virtually, depending on which rotation they are at. Any residency-wide or upper-level lectures occur here in this hall. This is the Friendsly Conference Room, where first-year residents gather for their own dedicated lectures and didactics. 
This consists of twice weekly team-based learning, or TBL for short. These TBL lectures help the first-year residents prepare for their core rotations with an open and interactive style of learning. The future of radiology in general is very bright, and specifically for the Baylor uh, College of Medicine radiology residents. There are three main reasons why I, why I think that. One is that we are um, uh, training them in the largest medical center in the world, and this provides a very uh, outstanding clinical and educational environment that allows them to flourish. The second uh, reason, I think, is because at the residency level on day one, we embrace, we expose them to the concept of imaging 3.0 that they understand their role as radiologists it doesn't end with a radiology report, but it's the totality of their experience with patient care. And the third thing is that both the faculty and our chairman and everybody across the different uh, hospitals is committed to uh, resident education and uh, providing them the tools so that they can be adaptable to change, which is critical in this environment of uh, ever-changing uh, medicine. The ESIR pathway is something that we've been very excited about here at Baylor. We've done a very good job of, of laying a solid foundation in interventional radiology and our trainees have gone on to match in very prestigious institutions for their independent IR residencies. One of the real strengths of our IR curriculum here just comes by virtue of the fact that we're located in the Texas Medical Center and we have a lot of affiliate institutions that our trainees rotate through. Watching our residents grow not only as professionals but as people as they progress through the program is, is really a sight to build. The faculty are excellent here. They really prioritize our learning. There was one instance where there was a very interesting case that I saw. The faculty pulled me aside and we talked about it in length and the next day he sent me an article, um, you know, really going through the finding and I really just appreciated that he took the time out of his busy day. So here at Baylor, we're a resident-run program. That means we have very few fellows, so we're right at the front lines to see all the, the cool cases. You really start out in the driver's seat from day one here. I mean, it's up to you to make the initial diagnosis and the critical calls here from the moment you start out in your first month. This program is great because you have the chance to train uh, an amazing, amazing residency program. I chose this program for a lot of reasons. I also love the city of Houston. I've been here now since college, almost a decade. It's a great city to explore, whether that be food or sports or you know anything pretty much, you can find it in Houston. We as a class actually spend a lot of time together outside of work. We see each other almost every weekend. Every year we start off with a, a big celebration in Galveston. All the residents will come, even some former residents, and the faculty and our program director will host us, and it's always a fun time. Their quest for knowledge is, uh, is inspiring to me. It keeps me young and, uh, and at the same time uh, maintains my, my uh, need for lifelong learning. I always look at the residents uh, in a way that if they succeed, I succeed. If they win, I win, and Baylor uh, wins. Baylor College of Medicine is truly an amazing place to train as a radiology resident. Residents learn how to deliver world-class care to patients while working at the largest medical center in the world with so many leaders in the medical field. Our program continues to foster well-rounded residents through our various leadership and extracurricular opportunities. We also get the privilege to live in one of the most culturally vibrant cities in the country with unmatched cuisine and so many activities to do in our free time. Thank you for joining us today and we hope you enjoyed learning about our program.